Hi, I'm Jan van der Stoel, International Musical Therapist and welcome to this week's episode of Uncovering the Cover of Celebrities. This week I tried to tackle the issue of Scientology, that strange religion that makes people pretty successful if they believe in UFOs. I did this by interviewing one of Australia's most successful female pop stars, Kate Sobrano. Check it. My next guest is a popular pop singer who has toured not just in Australia but overseas. She started her career in an all-girl group. She's won ARI awards and her albums have gone platinum and she's had numerous top five hits. She is one of Australia's most successful singer-songwriters and has had an award-winning Archibald portrait made of her. <laughs> she has successfully maintained a high-profile career for over 20 years. So, what was it like to be painted? Was it hard to sit still for hours? No, it was quite easy actually. I think there was a bit of photography involved. Oh, so they took a photo and then you didn't have to be like a naked model? <clears throat> no, but I wouldn't tell anybody that because I, I don't think they're allowed to do that. Oh, but I so, so, right, so they might get slipped off their class if they knew that, you right. think, or? I think that's actually spot on. Yes, mm. so this is, okay. I, I feel bad now though. That you've said it? Yeah, because the artist is a lovely lady and I don't want to get into trouble. Well, it's a bit mm. late now. But I'm going to spill the beans on all the other artists that do that that I know, just to even it up. All right, but maybe not on my show because it takes a long time. I think lots of youth people uh, think about what it would be like to win an award and have practiced their speech. Have you done that? And how much of it did you use when you won your arias? No, I didn't practice my speech. Never? Never with a shampoo bottle of anything like the viewers maybe did? No, I no, I didn't practice an acceptance speech, but I probably practiced other people's songs. Oh, like you, someone else would be famous or something. Yeah, yeah, bigger <laughs> songs. Mm. Oh, yeah, that's funny. Mm -hmm. Um, you have released eighteen albums. Ah, uh, no. What? No. 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 Uh, um, I've released less than eighteen albums. Oh, have you? <coughs> yeah. it's, oh, I got it. 18 on the internet. Okay, what is your favourite album? Of that I've done? Yes. Um, I don't know, I can't say that because I, I just feel like I was being disrespectful to, you know, the other ones. Other ones, I, yeah, yeah, hold on, okay. Because you know, there's a whole lot of people involved with doing an album. And of course. You if I say I like that one, then these people will say, oh, I But just... you've offended the, the painter, but this one you feel different. No, I didn't. Been the painter. No, okay. No, I was so, following your program. Oh, of course. Okay. So you're a Scientologist. <laughs> what is that? What is that like? No, you got be me mixed up with someone else. Is, no, I think you are a Scientologist, Kate. You've been and about if you, Kate. Mm, okay, I thought that. Thank you, Jan. That's lovely. But I'm not Kate. You know? No, I'm not Kate. I'm not Wendy. I'm Jenny. Jenny who? Morris. Jenny Morris. Mm, from New Zealand. Oh, yes, I do. I know you. Yes, <laughs> I do know you. You used to be very uh, famous in the 80s. Uh, so, uh, I'm very sorry. This is incredibly embarrassing because, but I thought you were Kate Sobrano. Oh, and what well, I want to know is... You've got then, the same colour here. Yeah, but, but not only that. I'm very sorry. That's very We've embarrassing. We've got the well, this is also true, but mm. I want to know how you did not stop me in the beginning. I've said you're a popular pop singer, you've toured Australia, <laughs> you were in an all-girl group, I mean, you won ARIA awards, so you did Archibald, um, you never stopped me, I said all these things. You don't have a secretary, do you? No. Mm. Okay. Right. No one to do your research. But you've done all these other things too, have you? You yes. have had an Archibald also. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> That's incredibly weird. Anyway, right. Oh, anyway. Um. Well, I would like to interview you, but um, it's it's 
bit of a stretch because, you know, the young people probably don't know who you are. <laughs> and, uh, I mean, Kate Sobrano, quite frankly, was already a little bit of a stretch. But I thought, you know, she often gets really fat and then skinny. And that is very uh, interesting for any age group. <laughs> so... Um, but anyway, thank you very stuff. much. Yes, of mm. course. Uh, mm. But thank you very much, Jennifer Morris. Hi. I'm the two-time ARIA award-winning singer-songwriter, very close friend of Neil Finn, Jenny Morris, and I could never have toured with the likes of the artist formerly known as Prince or been the subject of an Archibald Prize-winning painting or indeed had my two children if it hadn't been for Jan van der Stoel. I am Jan van der Stoel and it was lovely for you to have me.